Rockstar Games. Red Dead Redemption 2. Hallo und herzlich willkommen auf Bunker One. Ich bin Bunker. Und ja, warum soll ich noch viel erzählen über dieses Spiel? Es ist dermaßen durch den Hype gegangen. Wer das nicht mitbekommen hat, der weiß nicht, was eine Playstation ist. Von daher, loslegen. Ein Cowboy vor einer Hütte. Holzschein. Aussicht auf ein Gebirge und ein kleiner Hirsch. Wölfe. Ein heller und ein dunkler. Was haben wir hier? Eine Frau mit Hunden. Kein Durchgang. Draußen bleiben. Im schwarzen Bildschirm. Ach, Trommelmagazin als Ladesymbol finde ich auch ziemlich äh, stylo. Vor allem, es äh, bewegt sich, als wenn gerade geschossen wird. Hm. Komm, lass mich nicht hängen. Im Jahr 1899 neigte sich das Zeitalter der Gesetzlosen und Revolverhelden seinem Ende zu. Hm, ich hoffe, ich schaffe das schnell genug. Amerika wurde ein Land der Gesetze. <lacht> Sorry. Selbst der Westen war zum Großteil gezähmt. Ein paar Banden trieben sich noch herum, doch sie wurden gejagt und zur Strecke gebracht. Rockstar Games präsentiert. Red Dead Redemption 2 Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town, abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! Kapitel 1. Kolter. Das ist die Mehrzahl von Colt.
Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we going to do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're going to stay here, and you are going to get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're going to ride out, see if we can find one of them. This? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet. So they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith. Get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. I... We need you strong. Okay. All right. Let's head out. Ain't sure what we're gonna find. Boah, geht das gut von der Hand, ey. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Yeah. Careful over this bridge here. Tell me you at least got the money before it all went to hell on that boat. We did. It's stashed with the rest of the money in town. Hey, I think I see something up the path. Gentlemen, 
Found anything? <laughs> I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Er, <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. <laughs> I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Uh, okay. Let's head down there. Meine Gesundheit wird in der unteren linken Ecke angezeigt, okay? Die äußere Anzahl zeigt eine verbleibende Gesundheit, der Stand des inneren Kerns beeinflusst die Geschwindigkeit. Let me do the talk. We don't want to scare these folks. Oh, mit dem Schnee, das sieht so geil aus. Someone's having fun in there. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. Micah, hide behind that wagon. Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of you. Take cover in that shed over there. Hello? Shut up, Billy. Excuse me. Hello? Oh, well, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the trail. we got a problem. <laughs> folks. There's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur. need some... There's a body food in the wagon. Uh, I hear you. Just... Gentlemen. Keep your eyes on the Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, bud. Lass alle eins los, um ihn sie in die Hand zu nehmen. Mm -hmm. Now, friend, I ain't asking for much. Please, I am 
kind of desperate. Hey, I don't believe it. Come here, partner. Over there! Four of them! In there. Ah, Kreis drücken. Wo sind die denn? Größere Gebiete. Mhm. Jake and Sadie Wedding, September 96. Achso, ich kann es auch selber lesen. O'Driscolls, I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. One Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle. Is etwas. Für den Kern deiner Gesundheit etwas auf. Ah, okay. Place is dry, warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Da gehe ich gleich hoch. Ein Medizinschrank. I'm going to start packing the horses. You keep looking. Wird das irgendwie anvisieren? Nee. Oh. Ah, so gehe ich schon mal in Deckung. Das ist auch schon mal was. Bohnen. Kekse. Sieht schon äh, absolut genial aus hier. Ey. So springe ich, okay. <lacht> Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, 
You search the cabin, see what we missed. Sure. Ach, das hat doch noch Balken. Ja, ist ja gut, Boss. <lacht> train gonna blow the tracks no, I don't know more than that I swear <laughs> well I would say it looks like you have this Arthur do what you want with him I don't care but bring that horse when you're done Das soll ein Anbindefasten sein. Echt? Okay. Get on. 
Well, keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband. Somebody's coming! Looks like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back! How'd you get on? Uh, Mike have found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Cole O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting a train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food. And this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. <laughs> He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. <gasps> Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know the situation were reversed and he looked for me thank you this way last I know John was headed up the river for all we know he kept riding north and never looked back he wouldn't leave not like that uh, wouldn't be the first time Take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river. Let's cross. See, they continue up that way. Not that way. You think it's John? You tell me. 
These are horse tracks for sure, but could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. We continue along the cliff wall here. So dished. Davey got shot. Mac and John both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. <laughs> Easy. Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. schon beeindruckend. Oh, die Spuren im Schnee einfach nur. Das Licht ist absoluter Hammer, ey. Ist er mehr so der Fährtenleser oder? Fresh snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Almost there, boy. Come on now. Hey, look. Over there. You see that? was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Let's see if he can hear us. Come on. Up there. Yeah. Ja, ich glaube auch, dass es aus dieser Richtung kam. Halt der L1 gedrückt. Mit einer Schrotflinte. Ich 
wird unten rechts angezeigt. Achso. Was haben wir denn für Ausdauer? Kidneybohnen. Come on. That sounds closer now. Come on. Wahrscheinlich ist es gar nicht schon. Ah, es sieht schon geil aus. Richtig geil. Schade, wir sehen noch nicht so wirklich was von der Welt. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John, where are you? John, you there? John, can you hear me? John! John! I'm here! Down on the ledge! That's John! We're coming! Down here! Down here! All right! Hot down, Marston! That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. <laughs> Come on, compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. You all right? I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. See that on the ridge? Shit. I'll distract him while you get to the horses. Go! Draw them off. Okay, here we go, John. We'll leave them to Arthur. Nein! Get out of 
think so. Jesus. You still with us, Marston? Just <sighs> about. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. You should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. <laughs> See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Some help. We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. Come on, here we go. There we go. Uh, Ay, uh, careful, idiotas. Uh, it's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Uh, thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're going to get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. 